If you're like me, you enjoy the classic Halloween tradition of carving the pumpkin. But there is something that you didn't know. This event is not known by many, as the only documents of it have either been hidden or destroyed. The date of this is currently unknown, but it appears to go back really far. The story tells of a young man named Jack. He was a criminal. He secretly robbed villages and homes, but nobody could ever see him do it. Ever. He was so stealthy that you could do only see a flash of him. He didn't kill people, but he would still hold a reward for anyone who could bring his dead body back to the king. A king. That is why this most likely takes place in the medieval times. Soon, someone did see him. They described him to the king and his knights. It was shocking. He looked just like the town hero. That is why he never spoke of his name. And as soon as the king found this out, he ordered his men to go after him. But Jack stood up for himself, looking for the king. The knights very quickly surrounded him. They led him to the crazed king. Jack said, You people are so ungrateful for the good deeds that I have done. All you do is give me money and trail off like I'm nothing. That is why I became a thief. The king was furious and told his men to hold down Jack, but he used a different method of execution. He took a knife, carved open his head, and he did it while Jack was still alive. He took out the brain and whatever he could find. He chopped it into pieces and roasted it. What he did next was even worse. He carved a face into whatever was left and then lit it on fire. How did the method of this, with pumpkins, last throughout time? I guess I've yet to find out.